Oh, hello there, friends. I'm going to do a little review, another under the table review. Not review. I, tell, I don't do reviews. We're going to do a little tasting of some goodies that these guys sent me. This one is going to be... Ouch! My nuggets is! This one is clocking in at 6.6%. Um, this one is loaded with their uh, homegrown nugget tops. It's all homegrown nuggets. Um, and there is a lot of them in there. They did a first um, first wort hopping of uh, an ounce and a quarter. Um, is that correct? Yeah. Uh, one and a quarter ounces at first wort. Um, an ounce at 30, an ounce at 15, an ounce at 5. Um, flame out addition of one and a quarter ounces, and another ounce was chucked in the primary for dry hopping. Um, so it's, I mean, there's there's a lot of uh, a lot of hops in there. Let's see, it's, you got um, a quarter and a half and a quarter and a half. So you got two and a half, um, three and a half, four and a half, five and a half ounces of hops and then another ounce in the dry hop this that's pretty red so i'm pretty excited to try this clocks in at 6.6 percent without further ado ouch my nuggets is pop this elder peas nuggets was the original recipe and this is a uh this is a, uh, a remake of Elder Peas Nuggets. I'm assuming we have a bottle conditioned beer. So I'm not going to pour it all in. Get a little haze. That means it's good. When it has haze, it means all the good stuff's still in there. So that's pretty awesome. Oh man, it smells fantabulous. Um, curious to know what yeast you guys used in this one. Um, this one was brewed uh, in November, just in November, November fifteenth. Um, he, do, 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 do. they said the last one they tried was still hanging on pretty well, but I saw Nate actually talk today about how they popped one and they weren't sure if it was just a bad bottle or it just didn't. It, it started to fall apart, so I was like, oh, I have to hurry up and get on that. Smells great. Smells great still. Mmm. I'm digging in, guys. Oh. Yeah, that's good, man. That's good. Um, I myself have never worked with Nelson Hops. I actually, <clears throat> I'm going to do a little party foul real quick. Um, and while I'm kind of drinking this and talking to you guys uh i'm going to look up some of the characteristics of the nuggets hops um because i have never worked with them so total party foul i know total 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 party foul it's crisp it's very clean mm. I could um, drink a lot of those. 100%. If it wasn't 6.6%, I would probably drink a few of these. All right, let's see. Nugget Tops. Um, bittering type. Bred in 1970 from the USDA 65009 female plant and USDA 63015M plant. The lineage of Nuggets is 5 8 Brewer Gold, 1 8 Early Green, 1 16th Canterbury, um, 1 32nd Bavarian, and 5 32nds Unknown. Great bittering hop with a heavy herbal aroma. Absolutely. 12.5 to 14.5% <clears throat> alpha acids. It is, totally. Definitely. Definitely the bitterness for sure. But, uh,. Because it's so crisp, um, the bitterness does not hang on the tongue forever. 
It's like there, it's like there, kicks you in the tongue and rolls the fuck out. And you're like, damn, what was that? I need some more. Delicious, boys. Delicious. I'm curious to know what it tasted like fresh because this, again, is very, very, very good. Um, I would love to know what yeast you're using in this. If I had to guess, I would say you did a US 05 in this one. I don't get like any yeast really characteristics, but there's um, almost like a like a crisp kind of dryness that I get when I use US05 that I'm totally getting out of this as well. Really good. Really good. Thank you guys. Um, stay tuned. I have more beers coming this week and uh, lots more to try out. Um, good job, gents. Ouch, my nuggets is. If you guys brew this again, um, please put me on the list for a, uh, for, uh, one of those, because that's, that's very good, that's very good, thank you guys, have a good night, happy Monday.